it is here at one of our test tracks that we get the feedback we need to know that all our focus work back home really meets our customers' expectations. How do you test an electric vehicle with a 400 volt system, including hundreds of all new components and systems that were initially not developed for the automotive world? How do you safeguard that a new electric vehicle meets all legal, company and customer requirements in every area? And how do you define the tools needed to measure the project team's progress towards all defined goals? To answer these questions, a very comprehensive test program with many new test methods had to be invented. This became possible through unique and open cross-border collaboration among the project's many specialists. Altogether, there are close to 200 different defined tests, of which many are completely new. All these different types of tests would not be possible without a broad and deep electrical safety training program focusing on 400 volt technologies as a base. As Volvo's acting customers, we have been involved from the very beginning of the project when it comes to customer and driver interface. Most difficult with this project was that we didn't have any competitors in the segment as a reference. To test and decide what it means to drive, service, charge had to be done with our experience, how customer reacts on uh, today's Volvo cars. This, of course, in normal temperature, hot climate, and uh, this week in cold climate. When the temperature in northern Sweden was below minus 30 degrees, and the car was functioning great, I must say. Developing knowledge about risks and injury mechanisms that are associated with any electrical problem initiated the development of redundant systems that controls the same signals in separate ways to make sure that nothing unexpected will happen. It also included processes for service and maintenance in workshops so that workshop personnel would not be exposed to any risks associated with repairs. In the autumn of 2011, 50 cars will be used in a testing program among car users in different climates and regions in which the relationship between different driving behavior and battery life will be evaluated over about two years' time.